Nimron. Oke okay, teman-teman, kembali kita belajar bahasa Inggris lagi dengan metode pidato bahasa Inggris. Tidak intinya saya selalu mengupload video pembelajaran bahasa Inggris dengan metode pidato. Karena pada dasarnya dengan belajar pidato kita bisa melancarkan uh, apa namanya pronunciation kita untuk bisa lebih jelas lagi dalam uh, ngomong bahasa Inggris itu teman-teman. Dan pidato saya kali ini kita akan membahas tentang bahaya narkoba untuk kalangan uh, pelajar ataupun mahasiswa. Tentunya ini bisa kalian pakai ketika uh, mengikuti lomba ataupun ada acara-acara yang sifatnya itu formal tentang pencegahan narkoba menggunakan bahasa Inggris. Dan ini sangat bagus sekali untuk bisa kalian pakai di acara-acara tersebut. Oke langsung saja kita mulai. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Saya ingatkan kembali pada teman-teman yang belum subscribe karena subscribe itu gratis. Dan uh, saya punya uh, banyak tema tentang pilot bahasa Inggris. Bisa kalian cek di uh, daftar tonton atau list ya. Di playlist itu banyak sekali tentang judul-judul pilot bahasa Inggris. Oke langsung saja kita mulai. Good afternoon, dear colleges and the students of our Pratt University. Thank you for the opportunity to speak with you and thank you for coming today. Now, I am standing in front of you, portraying one big issue that becomes serious threat for youth in Indonesia, which is the danger of drugs for university students. It is not new that the use of addictive drugs is serious fact that we need to face comprehensively. Based on National Anti-Narcotics Agency, 27% of all drugs user comes from university students. There are so many kind of drugs, the approach as well. Actually, if we are talking about the danger of drugs, I'm sure that you understand about that. The same thing applies to the consequences from issue of drugs. Everyone must know the threat. But as we know, the drugs consumption rate with a university student is still high. How could this happen? In recent years, Indonesia is one of potential markets for the distribution of drugs. Since long time ago, Indonesia has been the place for transit and destination of drug supply. Dear students that I love, it is not a secret that Indonesia now is the emergency of drugs usage. What makes this more miserable? This condition involves those in AIDS of 24 until 30 years old. Youth is the most vulnerable generation to be involved in drug circle. What is the reason? Within the age of 24 until 30 years old is the time to seek self-actualization. The curiosity is elevated in their soul. The age is still unstable and easy to be influenced nowadays. The variant of new drugs is another factor that triggers the massive distribution of drugs. Within the age of university students, the change of social interaction with those who are involved in drugs world is big. The supplier will justify all means to approach youth and slowly brainwash and enclosure about drugs. Within this vulnerable age, they want to try new thing that can easily bring them to the dark circle of drugs. Moreover, university students is the face of having their own responsibility without others' authority. When a university student who has his own authority of himself but not accompanied with wise way of thinking, 
he will be easy to be dragged and involved in unfortunate situation of drugs. Thousand people died due to misuse of drugs. Please don't let all of you, the students from our prior university, and was your age by consuming drugs. The danger of drugs don't stop here. Once you are involved within misuse of drugs, you will face the sort coming from smallest things. You won't concentrate in studying and learning. This will also affect to your financial situation because it is not cheap to assess drugs. Most important and precious thing in this life is health. Once you are dragged in the circle of drugs, there are so many negative impacts toward, towards uh, toward health. There are also many proofs that drugs will dis disrupt youth, death at its worst. Dear students that I am proud of, the change to study of university is not coming twice. And you are already at college institution, never once tempted to try drugs. Don't wash your future for, don't wash your future for temporary pleasure. Pleasure. Guard yourself within positive activity to prevent from trying drugs. There is no such thing as just trying because of uh, because the addictive content of drugs will make someone ask for more with higher doses for those who ever involved in drugs come to us fill your day with positive activity so that you won't be tempted to go back in the illegal drug circle keep guarding yourself and be a productive student cheers Nah, itu tadi teman-teman pidato bahasa Inggris tentang bahayanya narkoba pada anak mahasiswa ya teman-teman ya. Ini juga bisa kalian pakai di anak-anak sekolah juga bisa. Ini tadi agak kurang lancar ya, tapi nanti saya coba upload lagi biar lebih lancar lagi. Ini karena saya agak sedikit ngantuk teman-teman. Oke, okay, terima kasih sudah menonton video ini. Sampai jumpa di video saya berikutnya. Thank you for watching. See you on my next video. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.